Every centrifugal fan application has bearings. Whether you see them or not, like you do in front of you right now, everyone has them. So if your motor is directly connected to your wheel, the bearings are within your motor. If your motor is not directly connected to your wheel, there's going to be a shaft between the wheel and the motor. Now it's gonna either be connected by a coupling or a V-belt drive. But then you have bearings that are holding your shaft in place. And the three most common types of bearings are split pillow block roller bearings, split pillow block or pillow block two bolt roller bearings, and solid pillow block ball bearings. We'll get into just some specifics on each of these three types. So the first type that we're looking at where the, the shaft is within these two bearings, these are four bolt split pillow block grease lubricated roller bearings. And so you can pop the caps on these and they're sealed on both sides. And the specific type we have in front of us are Dodge USAF type. These types are always going to be split pillow blocks. So you've got in the bearing housing, let's look at this one, it's split halfway up. You've got four bolts running through. You can pull these bolts out. You can pop this cap. You can get in and access the bearing, the grease inside of this one. The next type, this one is also a split pillow block, but this can also come in a solid pillow block style. On this one, it's a two bolt style, meaning that there's only one bolt on each side. And this specific one has a split cap, but it could be a solid cap. And on the back side, it's open. The seals are open here and grease can come out of the back side. The third type, this specific one we have, is a link belt bearing and this one is a 300 series and it's sealed on both sides and within this is a ball bearing these two are both roller bearing styles this one has a ball bearing and it is also a two bolt style so depending on whether you got a roller or a ball this one is specifically a roller bearing so this is what the rollers look like as it rotates and this one is a ball bearing. So this is what that looks like as it rotates. And specifically in front of me, the green ones have rollers and the black one has balls within it. 